Hi, I'm Paige Hamilton, and today I'm going to show you guys how to play Crashing Foreign Cars. I just uh, taught it to a student in Australia, so I thought I'd teach it to you guys. Um, we were making the Size Matters record way back in 2003, I think it was, and uh, my bandmates Chris Trainer, uh, John Tempest, and Rob Nicholson were um, sitting around while I was trying to write lyrics, and I said, why don't you guys come up with a fast song, something an arrangement that's that's fast and hard hitting. So they went in and jammed and came up with this uh, song. It's my, one of my favorite co-writes ever. I love it. They did an amazing job. So song starts with a, a, a Tempesta super cool drum fill and it goes straight into this riff. So it's a bunch of pull-offs and hammer-ons and slides and stuff. Uh, vocal comes in right away. We play the verse and uh, that goes to the chorus, which is an open, everything is open except for my pinky is on the eighth fret, the B string, um, the second string. We're actually tuned, sorry, C, G, C, F, A, D. It's drop C tuning, C, G, C, F, A, D. So um, if I screw up the concert pitch information, uh, I apologize. Uh, so here's this first chord. We maintain that shape uh, and then uh, move do the power chord on the bottom here on fret eight. So it's then move that power chord down to the uh, fifth fret. Still holding those open strings and that, that F there in concert pitch would be an F. Down to the third fret, same shape, but now that pinky is going to be on fret six, B string. So I do this, we do this, these hits together, and then I do this slidey thing. And I think I started on an upstroke. Exactly the same, except for the at the end of that, we go to this half step up, one fret up to the sixth fret, that same power chord we're holding, that, that our pinky down there on the eighth fret, uh, second string again, open uh, strings one and three. So this is really a major seven, and a sharp five. Those two intervals in there, there's no third. A lot of these chords don't have thirds. So this is... A little stop in there and then I uh, switch over live anyway to the solo thing, which is kind of this one note vibe. Kind of Uh, while the band keeps this groove. So I kind of I play this because uh, Chris wrote this this part, wrote uh, these these cool riffs. So when I'm learning somebody else's uh, riffs, I kind of slow it down. And what I did here is I kind of cheat and have my finger flat. So I'm, I, uh, but then my right hand just, because this is a single string uh, riff. <laughs> Anyway, that's how that's how I kind of work on stuff. Uh, oh, and the trash guys are here. Um, welcome to Los Angeles. Uh, okay, after that, that's sort of. Uh, um, and live, I kind of uh, play it on an upbeat. Of course. Same. Then we go. Tenth fret, but your pinky is in the eleventh fret, second string. That's a just a dominant seven chord, kind of like this. B 
flat seven. Then so then move that power chord up a half step to the eleventh fret. Still holding that pinky on fret eleven um, on the second string, and then open. It's just a, um, a diminished seven chord. Just kind of this movement. play that together at the end. That's it. Okay. Hope you're doing well. Thank you. Have a great day. Bye.